the following diagram shows a circle with center O and a radius R. Angle AOB is theta radians. Sector OAB is divided into two regions, a shaded segment P and a triangle Q. The area of a shaded segment P is 12.8 cm squared. The areas of P and Q are in the ratio 3 to 5. Find the value of R. So, since uh, the area of P is given, we can find the area of a triangle Q. It's uh, just uh, uh, 5 over 3 times uh, uh, greater. Or the area of P is 3 parts, and if you divide 12.8 uh, uh, by 3, you get uh, per 1 part, and you need 5 parts because the area of Q is 5 parts. You then multiply by 5 and it becomes 64 over 3 and we know that the area of a triangle is equal to a half side multiplied by side and multiplied by sine of the angle between them so it becomes r times r which is r squared and multiplied by sine of theta and you can see that theta is unknown so we should find theta and we need another equation. We can consider the area over sector because we know a formula for the area over sector and area over sector OAB is it's, uh, the sum of areas P and Q so it, it uh, will be in ratio uh, with uh, P so ratio P to area over sector OAB. This ratio is 3 to 8. And hence uh, the area over sector is 8 over 3 times greater than uh, uh, the area of P, or again. If you divide 12.8 by 3, you find per one part, and uh, the required area of a sect is 8 parts, so you then multiply by 8. Hence, we get that area, area O sector OAB is 8 over 3 times 12.8 and it's uh, 102.4 over 3 and we know that uh, the area of a sect is a half uh, radius squared times theta and theta must be in radians and we get simultaneous equations. We can, uh, we can divide both sides to get rid of r squared to get an equation in terms of theta only and find theta. Uh, so it becomes 64 over 102.4 is half cancels, r squared cancels, sine theta over theta. Notice that you cannot solve for theta and using substitution because if you substitute you get r squared sine of something r squared and using the calculator and first of all we need radian mode it must be radian mode and function is and let rearrange so it becomes a uh, cross multiplication uh, 64 theta is uh, 100 um, and something sine you may consider two graphs, but I want to move uh, to one side to, uh, to consider only one graph. So minus 102.4 times sine of theta is zero. So 64x minus 102.4 times sine theta is uh, 
angle and and um, I need uh, what x intercept um, zero of a function so just x uh, uh, axis to be seen it is required uh, uh, just uh, x axis to be seen so I can choose uh, y to be for example from negative to to, to and x it's uh, angle in radians it's let it be from definitely it's a uh, cute angle let it be from 0 to 1.5 so let it be to 0 0.5 and from negative 1 to 1 or we check point O let it be four aha uh -huh. so actually we need this and let one two so up to two and let increase y from negative 5 to 5 and we need this point and let increase y from negative 10 to 10 And we need x intercept to zero. Zero left bound. Yes. This right this and guess this. So it's uh, one point five nine nine. 1.599 3, 4 and so on radians and then let's substitute into this so so R is square root of what two times one hundred and two point four divided by three and divided by theta so it becomes it becomes uh, two hundred and four point eight divided by 3 and divided by the answer and then square root and it's uh, 6.53 to three significant figures centimeters and that's all for this question